This is all new Fiat Toro. Fiat Toro may not be the rival of the Santa Cruz or Maverick. In Brazil, Stellantis is preparing to present an upgraded version of the small pickup model Fiat Toro. The unibody truck Fiat Toro has been sold in Latin America since 2016 and is its Ram 1000 model at 193.5 inches long and 772.6 inches wide compared to the recently released Hyundai Santa Cruz is 2.2 inches shorter and 2.4 inches narrower. The Fiat Toro model will not be sold in US with a RAM logo, so the two models will not be in the competition. The new changes in this upgrade are updated split headlights with upper sections featuring a full LED setup acting as a turn signals and daytime running lights. The fog lights also switch to light emitting diodes, and the main clusters are thinner than before while using LEDs on upper spectrum levels. These changes give the Fiat Toro a more robust, sharpy look. The most visible change is the front grille, as it now features the Fiat logo with the large letters to mirror the corporate identity used by other recent products of the Italian brand, including the smaller Strada pickup Aka Ram 700. Fresh alloy wheels are debuting with a facelift, varying a size from 16 to 18 inches depending on the trim. Fiat has changed the whole interior in the new style to make the car more attractive. The most prominent design is the portrait spine infotainment measuring 10.1 inches and similar in appearance to what you will find in Ram's American trucks. Is the optional touchscreen as the lesser versions have a landscape display with either a 7 or 8.4 inches diagonal. Fiat also equips the base model a 7 inch fully digital instrument cluster. In terms of engines, the Fiat also trained completely when equipped with a new turbocharged 1.3 liter engine feeding on gasoline ethanol. It produces 185 horsepower and 200 pound feet of torque channeled exclusively to the front wheels via a six speed automatic transmission. For both engine versions, Fiat Toro will have both 4x2 and 4x4 versions available. The most powerful version is a 2.0-liter turbo diesel with 170 horsepower and 258 pound feet of torque. Send both also through a 9 speed automatic. The Fiat Pozo is sold in Brazil with the following trims Endurance, Freedom, Volcano, Ranch, and Archer. Car prices start from $21,000 US dollar. I hope you could find something interesting when watching the video. Thanks again for watching.